there's a time when I was channeling the Sabiatha where I got so overwhelmed by the eight key code mentors <laughs> and all this information that was coming from every direction. I didn't know what page to write next because everyone was so excited to share and, and it was all interwoven. It was all intertwined. I mean, can you imagine like the codex did not come in those complete chapters. It took me seven years to sort out the order. And, and I, I, I'm not going to go into what that was like, but I got to a point in the project where I was like, enough. I need to integrate, you know, talking to Hathors and Buffalo and dragons and Magdalene's. Like, I'm, it's so overwhelming because at that time of my feeling, it was just so overwhelming. And I sat at the feet of Mother Mary, my Mother Mary statue for a year and a half. And I said, I will write the codex, but for now, I will, I will write what Mother Mary wants me to write. I will meditate with Mother Mary. I will learn from Mother Mary. And it was from that space that I learned how to be in a new way with all the other mentors. So I'm really excited that I get to go back to sitting at the feet of Mother Mary for the next year with all of us. Um, because I think it's going to bring greater insight as to how we can deepen in our mental relationships with each of these key codes and